New Robotic Combat Vehicle Debuts at Cydex Show Croatian robotics firm DOKNG and Slovenian turret specialist Valhalla have unveiled a new integrated unmanned ground combat system, pairing the MV-8 Komodo robotic platform with the Mangart 25AD remote-controlled turret. The joint system made its world debut this week during the Cydex defense exhibition in Slovenia, backed by support from the Slovenian Armed Forces and Defense Industry Partners. According to DOKNG, the MV-8 Komodo offers high mobility, survivability, and off-road performance, while providing a platform suitable for a wide range of defense tasks, including forward operating base protection and remote perimeter security. The platform's integration with the Mangart 25 AD turret marks a new phase in autonomous ground warfare development. The Mangart 25 AD, developed by Valhalla Turrets, is a short-range air defense turret equipped with Raymetal's 25mm KBA autocannon and BDA SATA missile launchers, a Henselt Spexer one-quarter AESA radar, and a Safran Paseo electro-optical sight. In a joint statement, Valhalla said the turret offers precision, reliability, and versatility, and is designed to address both air and ground threats in low-intensity and conventional conflict environments. The turret features 400 rounds of ready-to-use 25 by 137 mm ammunition. According to Valhalla, the Raymetal KBA provides a high rate of fire, reduced recoil, and compact architecture suited for unmanned integration. The company emphasized that the turret can be deployed in both mobile and stationary roles, including ground-to-ground -ground and short-range air defense operations. In a statement, DOKING said, of a new force in modern defense is born. The company described the system as a response to modern battlefield requirements, combining remote lethality with unmanned survivability. Valhalla Turrets echoed the sentiment, stating the collaboration pushes the boundaries of safety, reliability, and intelligent defense. The MV-8 Komodo is part of DOKING's growing family of unmanned ground vehicles and has previously been fielded in engineering and mine clearance roles. Its military adaptation for weapon integration is intended to support base security, route clearance, and rapid deployment in high-risk environments. The system is part of a broader trend toward unmanned force protection solutions that can deliver scalable firepower without exposing personnel. While neither company disclosed a production timeline or customer list, officials involved in the demonstration said the system is operationally ready and modular in design, enabling further configuration depending on mission requirements. Valhalla and DOKNG both expressed appreciation to their industrial partners Rainmetal, Henselt, Safran, and MBDA for their role in enabling the integration. The companies stated they are now exploring follow-on applications and export opportunities.